I will fix this without tools. Uh, Murray, you do know the tools are inside the house. The right? Murray doesn't need tools. Yeah, fuck you, Bentley. <laughs> Anyways, hey. welcome back to slide two, where we're going to finish, uh, finish up uh, Menace of the North. Eh? Eh? Oh, oh fuck, Jesus. eagles. <laughs> they're, they're pissed at us. We stole their eggs. Well, no shit. Anyways, we bought the Bentley's last item, which is just a shitty-ass uh, uh, bomb. So, let's uh, continue on. And there's Jean Besson himself. Jean Besson. Mm -hmm. Even though it's spelled Gene Bison. Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit, he's the brother of M. Bison. Uh, that's shit. actually... That's actually the French way of spelling John. That guy's huge. Oh, yeah. He's big, he's... he's a pioneer and he's ready to kick your ass. And he's Canadian. Excuse and he's Canadian. Me, sir. We humble lumberjacks would like to participate in your lumberjack game. That's a terrible accent. That's that's just as bad as Sly's Italian accent. Well, you'll find out. Yeah, we'll, yeah. we'll find out next game actually. That's and yeah. I'll, I'll save a funny bit of dialogue. We'll, we'll for save that. a joke for later. We'll we'll put it in the vault. We'll uh, just take a uh, I see what you did there. Anyways, we have to cheat our way to win uh, the Clockwork Talons for this. Because remember, John Basson uh, put up his talons for uh, reward in the competition. Alright. Don't screw this up, Chris. Murray with... Alright. So to ex There's no like uh, time limit to this. You just gotta chop it onto the log. If you miss, you automatically fail. Oh, that was pretty good. Mm -hmm. Although, I think the climbing part you might have an issue with. Oh, yeah, the climbing is a bitch. Yeah, the Murray's good at chopping wood. But what does this have to do with strength again? Okay, Bentley, you're on. Plant the eagle egg on Bassan, and the angry So we have to walk around with, like, we're carrying a bomb and plant it on John Bassan. Seems some. Oh, no! Oh, shit. The revenging. The revenging. Jesus. Eagles like right on you. This time it's personnel. Nothing Jeez. personnel, turtle. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I was sort of funny. Also, don't fall in the water, it's an automatic fail. You know, by the time this goes out, I think Sonic Forces will finally come out. Yeah, no kidding, right? <laughs> Everyone's ready to make Stone Cold the Hedge Hedge. I can't. I can't wait. Or a, or a, a donut steel. It's true though. Uh, punch the tree. <laughs> punch the tree. <laughs> oh shit! Where the fuck did that come from? Oh, and they gave him all zeros because he ducked. That's kind of harsh. How he doesn't notice Bentley is amazing, and why Bentley hasn't moved is amazing too. Yeah, it's not like Sly planted it on him where he's actually blue. Why was it? Why, why was it Bentley that did it? Now they think about it. Because he's the only one who uh, has the bomb like carrying animation. All right, this one is probably the hardest one, both in terms of the actual challenge and what you have to do to stop John Bison. Yeah, I'm, this kind of fucking sucks to be honest. Whoa, shit. Um, Oh, oh, okay. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Oh, oh, okay, you can recover. You can recover. You did it. Recovery, Sly, and perfect tens all around, despite getting zapped. So you did a good job. Good job. Pretty good for a scrawny raccoon. Jesus, that's racist. Oh, yeah, we destroyed those earlier, and now they reappeared. Okay. Oh, this part sucks. Yeah, this part can suck. Why doesn't he just tackle him? Oh shit. Yeah, no aiming reticles. So. Alright, alright, you got one, you got one. You'll be fine. Oh, nice! First try. Okay, come on. Shit too high. Fire! No, that, no, damn it. that got him. No. no. Damn it. Last try, last try! Come on. Bullshit! Oh, fuck. Oh, I hate this one. It's weird how he automatically wins. This makes no sense. I know, right? And he skips over the fucking ice climbing, so... 
There we go. Okay, okay, good start, good start. You got this now. Yeah, I got this by the ass, oh shit. <gasps> you did go. it! Ow. You know, if if that was anyone but John Bisson, they'd probably crack their skull open. I gave him a bad review on Yelp. <laughs> I like how they're wearing sunglasses. No, their eyes are closed, actually. Oh, shit. <laughs> this one's actually pretty easy. You just have to double jump and not uh, uh, go I know, off the logs. I do know this is a real thing, but they use one log and two people on it. Yeah. Oh, no, oh, oh, no. Did you just cheat? No, they make they make Bentley intentionally floaty for this part. <laughs> oh, oh shit. shit. Legs of yours just can't move fast <laughs> You're a dick, he's drowning. <laughs> but uh yeah, aside from the fuck up, like this is actually pretty easy. Bentley, the moon jumper. Uh, oh no! I got a little caught up in the fucking like what? <laughs> you dick, he's dying. <laughs> he's he's getting hypothermia, you asshole. Yeah. He's a turtle. He'll be fine. He's a turtle. That's racist. <laughs> not all turtles can swim. Hashtag not all turtles. Uh, okay, that's that's uh, just now. Don't do that. All right, we crossed the line there, friend. Fuck, fuck, fuck! I'm not gonna fall in the water again. No, no, not. Don't say that, Chris. You gotta say Shadow Realm. <laughs> okay, that doesn't have the same ring. Bentley didn't moon jump that time, and he got me a little nervous. Come on, we're almost there, home stretch. My ass is puckered. <laughs> oh, we nailed this. <laughs> you look like you're about to fall off. What's funny is that you can actually walk back onto the mainland and it, it automatically fails you. It does count as cheating. You're right, Murray. Those guys need to slide in, grease up the log, so. Yeah, they're changing the plan now. They know that they can't win. When if those judges are still there, so they're gonna switch places. Mm -hmm. So this is uh, one of the other required items that I mentioned earlier being put to use. The alarm what? The alarm clock gadget. The what? The what? The alarm clock gadget. Fly, did you buy the alarm clock? Um, that was like, Fly, you dumbass! That was months ago, Bentley. You know, by the time we actually got it in this game, it was probably months ago. Yeah, <laughs> to be fair. Okay, let me make sure it's equipped, first of all. Like Bentley said, we have to lure the judges over with the fucking alarm clock. Yeah, it has to be in the cave. And you have to lure them towards the cave. Oh, shit. Oh. Fuck, he didn't jump in the barrel automatically. What's weird is that they still allow like the animations to go out uh, even when you fail the mission. <laughs> they gave you pity. I give you point out of pity. Alright, let's try this again. And listen. Oh my god. Bentley beat him to death with his crossbow. <laughs> Don't Jesus. fuck with the turtle. Hey, wait, he gave him the good old turtle power. There we go. Did he give him a taste of turtle power? <laughs> no. Nice. 
Murray just took the duck's face and like smashed it against the fucking like cave wall. There we go. And as for Sly, he gave him a stern talking to and convinced him to give him his clothes and his duck bill. <laughs> Zero. Zero. Three! <laughs> <laughs> what he tried. I thought I warned you judges about the consequences for incorrect scores. Wait a Whoa, second. What? You aren't the judges uh -oh. I hired. It's the scrawny raccoon and his annoying friends. Shit. Well, if you want the challenge, then why don't you just take them? Holy shit! They should be dead. You should... just got a triple kill. <laughs> he just chucked it at him. How none of you have a concussion is amazing. Those talons really pack a punch. Sly! Murray! Wake up! Yeah. Oh, I felt like I got so hit in the head with a stick. A that's because that's what happened, Sly. They also had these sharp metal things on them. I don't know if you noticed. We kind of needed those and we got fucked over. If you want it so badly, fucking take it then. Fucking he he fucking it. strike rates us. <laughs> God. Unless. Unless what? Unless you can fit through that hole. Huh? Convenient. I wonder they have a hole for that. Maybe it's trash chute. I don't know. Mm. Considering the area below, I wouldn't be surprised. You might be able to help me with these sawmill controls. While you guys do that. I'll try prying open that steel door. Given enough time, I might be able to make some progress. All right. <laughs> Jesus, that does look heavy as fuck. Sounds like a plan. Good luck, Bentley. And remember to shout if I can help you from up here. <sighs> Holy shit, Sly! They they have a uh, Chick Fil A down here. Bentley, you okay? Nice. I can't see you from in here, but I heard the fall. I'll be fine. Just give me a oh. moment to catch my. Well now, Candy Bridges. Candy Bridges. I just figured a puny turtle like you'd find a rat hole to squirm through. Well, I just dropped my glasses, had to come pick them up. That's what they all say, eh? I ain't stupid. Stupid? <laughs> they actually have to spell that out like that. <laughs> oh, oh, fuck. fuck. Shit. I wouldn't expect one of your kind to understand the finer points of commerce. These turtles are too stupid to know a woodcutter from a woodchuck. That's it. I could tell the difference. You just how stupid <laughs> yeah, great comeback, Bentley. Really Thank you, Sly. Sly, on my command. I hear you. Prepare yourself, Bissan. I'm God. So, we don't have our conventional, um, tool of weaponry for this. We actually have to use, um, the square triangle and circle buttons to activate traps. Triangle for saw, square for fire, circle for these, uh, logs. Just don't get hit by the traps yourself. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, John is actually pretty, uh, simple. He just charges you. And then uh, he brings in his uh, goons. Yeah, he brings in goons, and I think at half his health, he'll start throwing dynamite at you. Yeah. So he's a pretty easy boss. He can be. He can be, but you, you need the preparation for him a bit. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> I'm just spamming the saw blade at this point. <laughs> burn! Burn, baby, burn! Disco Inferno! Canadian Inferno. How does that not kill him? All right, He's yep. a fucking tough ass Canadian. He's been frozen for like, what, a hundred years? Yeah. So, yeah, I feel, feel like he's ready for anything. So now he'll charge and throw dynamite. 
<laughs> You're stun locking him. Uh, one of the things he actually says though is that, um, like if you die to him, he says, Anyone ready for turtle soup? Huh, <laughs> nice. Turtle soup. Actually, one thing that I want to try and do is, um, is beat him while being on fire. Just let, let the ducks get out of him. I did a lot of teams, to be honest. It's fire. What do you expect? I think you can now. No, use strong dynamite. See? Ah. <laughs> Benly is Super Saiyan God. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Bentley, you're on fire. What are you talking about, Sly? Well, Bentley's like... <laughs> Jesus Christ. He summoned the power of the... <laughs> tailed fox. Yeah, there you go. Seriously, <laughs> I've never seen the fire effect, like, be this bad. It's I actually know. doing the fire blast animation from Pokemon. Yeah, it looks just like it, too. Jesus Christ. Similarities. We gotta run, boys! <laughs> Mainly because Bentley's on fire. <laughs> God damn it, that was awesome. But, um... Yeah, let me just, um, you know... I'm trying! I have very short legs! But yeah, don't even worry about guards, just get to the silo. Yeah. Oh, that was fast. Kind of defeats the purpose of the timer, to be quite honest. Murray, there's a trampoline right there. Why do you need to throw me? You're afraid of heights? Holy shit, man. <laughs> They're in a hole. We lost everything. As we shut ourselves into the Northern Light Battery, it became black. For a few long minutes, we just sat there in darkness. No one dared to talk for fear that John Bassan's men might discover where we were hiding. Time seemed to have stopped. And then, we felt it. We were being lifted up to Arpeggio's blimp. It was all so strange. The focus of all our schemes had been stolen from us. Our clockwork parts were gone. Looking around the inside of the battery, I knew we all felt it. Failure. I was twitchy and ready for action. Any action. Bentley tried to make some sense of the situation by drawing up meaningless plans. But Murray? Murray took it the worst. He just sat there sobbing while the team van floated away over the horizon. That van was his life. I knew I'd have to find a way to make it up to him. We lost our clockwork parts, we lost our van, and we even lost our confidence. Well, shit, this game got dark. Let's see if they have a special uh, movie for episode 7. Woohoo! Huh. That'll kill the mood. <laughs> Talk about a mood shift. There we go. Nope. He's asshole. <laughs> but anyways, shall we start episode 8? Or should we wait? Suspense. Goodbye.